Welcome to Vinuta's Math Channel. This is the class 11 of the Probability Distributions chapter. Uh, this is the fourth problem. If you have any doubts, you can join the Telegram group and you can ask your doubts and get clarified very soon. The fourth problem is find the value of k such that the following distribution represents a finite probability distribution. We need to find the value of k here such that the given distribution is the finite probability distribution. That means the addition of all these things will be equal to 1 and each and every value will be greater than or equal to 0. Hence find its mean and standard deviation. First we have to find the value of k such that this given uh, distribution is finite probability distribution then we have to find the mean and standard deviation by using the formulas. Also find p of x less than or equal to 1 and p of x greater than or equal to 1 and p of x it is between minus 1 to 2 okay we have to solve this problem first they are asking us to find the k value okay so the condition for uh, probability finite probability distribution the two conditions are p of x must be greater than or equal to 0 and the second condition is the summation of p of x must be equal to 1 here the first expression says these each and every values of p of x must be positive this must not be a negative value that's it then after adding all these things all these values we must get the value as 1 so let us use the second expression for that k plus 2k plus 3k plus 4k plus 3k plus 2k plus k this must be equal to 1 we need to add 1 plus 2 uh, 1k plus 2k is 3k 3 plus 3 is 6 6 plus 4 10 13 15 16k 16k is equal to 1 therefore k value is 1 by 16 we found the value of k that was the first part of the question that that has to be find okay first part is done hence they are asking us to find the value of mean the formula for mean is mu will be equal to summation x into p of x right we have to solve this before solving this we have to substitute the value of k in this table so let me redraw this table once again here x p of x minus 3 minus 2 0 1 ok if we substitute the value of k here it will be easy for us to proceed with the next questions ok so the value of k is 1 by 6 1k it is nothing but 1 into k 1 by 16 next it is 2k 2 into 1 by 16 so let us write it as 2 by 16 3 into 1 by 16 as 3 by 16 similarly 4 by 16 3k 3 by 16 next 2 by 16 it is 1 by 16 now mu is equal to summation x into p of x so we can multiply these two plus multiplication of these two plus multiplication plus multiplication okay uh, i'm giving you a homework kind of thing so uh, you can solve the value of mu and comment your answer in the comment section okay next for the variance also uh, no not for the variance standard deviation okay 
standard deviation for finding the standard deviation first we have to find the variance variance formula is summation x minus mu whole square into p of x we will find the value of mu from this expression after finding the mu value we have to substitute that value in uh, variance equation here and we have to find the variance value okay i have already shown the three problems how to solve how to find the value of mu that is mean and variance so i am uh, giving this problem for you to have a try <coughs> after finding the variance to find the standard deviation standard deviation is nothing but the square root of variance okay answer for this part also and then comment in the comment section comment your answer there you write it as fourth problem mean answer then standard deviation or variance answer and standard deviance standard deviation answer okay the next part of this problem is okay the next part is to calculate the probability of x less than or equal to 1 then probability of x greater than or sorry greater than 1 probability of x lies between minus 1 and 2 including this 2 okay first let us take let us start with p of x less than or equal to 1 here we have a probability distribution table okay we will make use of this and we'll find the value of p of x less than 1 p of x less than or equal to 1 means we have to find the value of probability such that we have to consider the values of probability such that the x value must be less than or equal to 1. Here in this table, here 1 is there, less than or equal to 1. We have to consider the values of x such that the x value is less than or equal to 1. So, we have, we need to consider all these values. Okay, all these values of x the corresponding p of x values we have to add okay so p of x less than or equal to 1 means it is nothing but addition of p of x equal to minus 3 plus p of x equal to minus 2 plus p of or we can simply write p of minus 1 plus p of 0 plus p of 1 fine let us copy the values p of x equal to minus 3 is 1 by 16 so it is 1 by 16 plus p of minus 2 is 2 by 16 plus p of minus 1 is 3 by 16 p of 0 is 4 by 16 p of 1 is 3 by 16 common denominator so 16 is LCM add the values in the numerator 4 plus 2 6 6 plus 3 7 sorry 6 6 plus 3 9 9 plus 1 10 10 plus 3 13 so it will be equal to 13 by 16 therefore P of x less than or equal to 1 is equal to 13 by 16 similarly p of x greater than 1 here they are asking us to find the value of probability for the values of x greater than 1 they have not included the 1 here greater than 1 means we have to exclude 1 and take the next values the next values are 2 and 3 that's it so p of 2 plus p of 3 2 by 16 plus 1 by 16 which is equal to 
थ्री बाई सिक्सटीन इफ द हैड एज टू पी ऑफ एक्स ग्रेटर देन और इक्वल टू वन इक्वल टू दैट मीन्स एट दैट केस एट दैट इंस्टेंट वी हैव टू कंसिडर द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू वन ऑल्सो इन दैट केस वी हैड टू इंक्लूड दिस वैल्यू ऑल्सो बट दे आर सेंग इट इज एक्स ग्रेटर दैन वन दैट इट सो वी हैव टू एक्सक्लूड वन एंड द वैल्यूज आफ्टर द वन वी हैव टू कंसिडर नेक्स्ट थर्ड द थर्ड पार्ट इन दिस टाइप इज दे आर आस्किंग अस टू फाइंड द प्रोबेबिलिटी ऑफ एक्स लाइज बिटवीन माइनस वन एंड टू हियर दे हैव नॉट इंक्लूडेड द माइनस वन हियर इक्वल्स टू इज नॉट देर सो वी हैव टू एक्सक्लूड माइनस वन स्टार्ट आफ्टर द माइनस वन वैल्यू एंड अप टू टू एंड हियर दे हैव इंक्लूडेड टू ऑल्सो ओके आई थिंक यू गॉट टू नो हाउ टू राइट द प्रोबेबिलिटी वैल्यूज फॉर दिस टाइप सो पी ऑफ माइनस वन लेस दैन एक्स लेस देन और इक्वल टू टू विल बी इक्वल टू लेट मी गो टू माइनस वन फर्स्ट माइनस वन दे आर सींग द एक्स वैल्यू इज ग्रेटर दैन माइनस वन और माइनस वन इज लेस दैन एक्स ओके दे हैव नॉट इंक्लूडेड द माइनस वन वैल्यू सिंस इक्वल्स टू सिंबल इज नॉट देर सो आई विल नॉट टेक माइनस वन आई हैव टू कंसिडर द वैल्यूज आफ्टर दिस माइनस वन सो जीरो दैट इज पी ऑफ जीरो प्लस पी ऑफ वन टिल विच वैल्यू वी हैव टू राइट दिस गोस ऑन टिल एक्स वैल्यू इज लेस दैन और इक्वल टू टू सो टू इज इंक्लूडेड इक्वल टू इज दैट टू इज इंक्लूडेड वी हैव टू राइट टिल पी ऑफ टू write the values and add p of 0 is 4 by 16 plus p of 1 is 3 by 16 p of 2 is 2 by 16 don't simplify here 2 by 16 as 1 by 8 why because if we keep as it is without simplifying the denominator you will get will be same so it will be easy for you to simplify that's why 16 common so lcm Four plus three is seven. Seven plus two is nine. So the answer is nine by sixteen. Okay. If you like our video, hit the like button. Comment your opinion in the comment section and do subscribe to our channel. If you have any doubts or queries, you can join our Telegram channel. The link will be provided in the description box. Thank you for watching. Keep supporting. Happy learning.